Hi everyone, welcome to another home edition. Today I want to show you a craft using materials you should have at home. So for this activity, you're going to need some cling wrap, so you should be able to find some of this in your kitchen, a toilet paper roll. If you don't have one now, if you wait a couple days, you might have one. You'll need a flashlight, a black marker, you just need one rubber band, I brought a couple just in case, and a pair of scissors to help cut this. So the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to need to have cling wrap cover the outside of this. I don't need this giant piece of cling wrap, I just need a little piece. So I'm going to take this, kind of do a little measurement, and I'm just going to cut a little corner of my cling wrap. If you want to get a big piece of cling wrap, you can make a couple different designs and change it out. But we're just going to start with this little guy here. So I know I have a space about that big. I'm going to take my black marker and I'm going to make a little design in there. You can use any color marker, but for our experiment, it's going to come out black on the wall anyway. We're going to be dealing with shadows. So I'm going to go and I'm going to make little star points. Eep. I'm going to make my outside shape and then I'm going to color it in. They're not very good stars, but they'll show up quite nicely, I think, on the wall when we put them up. Let's make a bigger one. Or you can always do the good old one, two, three, four, five. Get a couple of those. So now I have a couple of star shapes on my cling wrap. The next step, you're going to want to put this right over your design so it's in the center part of the toilet paper roll. And you're going to pull this up. So now when you have it, you'll pull it tight. You can see my design hanging out there. We're going to get this wrapped around. Here's the part where if you want to make other designs, I have a lot of extra cling wrap. So I could go ahead and do the same thing again. I know I needed about, whoops, this much. You can make a couple different designs because it's really easy to change these out because all you have to do is take off the rubber band and remove the cling wrap and put the new one on. So we can go ahead, I'm going to make a real simple one here, just a smiley face. So for the next part, I can't show you on the table, we're going to do a cutaway and I'm going to take you to a dark room. All right, so now we're going to have some fun and play around with our shadows. I know when I was testing it out earlier, it's really hard for me to, to show you how good it looks here. But if I kind of pull back, you can definitely see my smiley face there. And here's my star one. So you can see them. So you'll have to mess around with your own, find a good, happy, dark room, and see what kind of shadows you can come up with. Have fun. <laughs> 